Hello, it's Vince Stanzioni here. In this short video, I'm going to go through a brand new product which is exclusively available from Deriv called Accumulators. Now, we can trade these in demo mode or in real mode. In this case, I'm just going to use demo mode. And we can trade these on your laptop, your iPhone, um, or your tablet via the um, Deriv app. So, let's get started. Now, the first thing, what is an accumulator? It's a relatively short-dated um, option and it will last anything from a few seconds to maybe one minute. And as the word suggests, accumulate, the profits will compound until either two things happen, either that you take the profit or it hits one of these barriers. Now, if it hits the barrier, um, you'll be stopped out. Now, the good news, it's an option, so the most you will lose is your stake. So if you stake $10, $100, that would be your maximum um, loss. However, um, any accumulated profits obviously would also be lost as well. Um, but as I say, your maximum risk will be known. Now, what we can select with accumulators is the growth rate. Now, higher the growth rate, obviously more money we, we can make. Um, however, we're also taking more risk because what is happening is the band will be narrowing. And we go from anything from 1% to something in the middle, 3%, or five. Now, for this example, I'm going to go with the high risk, high growth, uh, which is 5%. Okay. Now, we can also choose what product underlying we want to trade the accumulator on. R right now, it's the popular volatility indices, which are the main products uh, which are available. And I'm going to go with the volatility 100, one second. Okay. Now, you can only have one trade running at a time at present. But of course, you can mix and match. You can sort of trade volatility 100, you can trade volatility 10, you can trade a 1% growth or a 5%. Now, once you actually select your growth and you click buy, you can't change the growth. Um, however, also on the next trade, you can have a different combination. So let's see them in action. If we click on buy, okay, you can now see the trade is open and this is the profit that is running. Okay, and now I'm gonna click sell. Okay, and on that particular um, trade, I made $47. Okay, so now it's closed. It doesn't matter. Now, the trade is actually still running because it hasn't hit the barrier, but we've actually taken our profits here. And if we look down here, we can see how many ticks have been running before that trade basically gets stopped out. So this one's still running at 42. There you go. Did you see it just went red and it stopped out? And now we've gone to zero. We also have stats for the last hundred or so trades, which you can actually just copy and move out as well. So you've got some history here as well. Uh, we can also add technical tools. So you can save these in templates or just add them as you go along. Now, remember, this is a relatively short term um, option. So a lot of tools are not going to work. You can't use candlesticks because it's just not long enough. So here I've saved a couple of uh, technical um, templates. So this one, I've got the rate of change running, which is one indicator that you could possibly use. Um, and you can add these. And then in this one, I believe I've got the MACD. Yeah, I've got the MACD and I've got the RSI, the relatively strength, relative strength. So it's another tool you can use as well. You can also use moving averages. You can add Bollinger Bands. Um, but as I say, you're always going to be staying in a in basically a tick chart because it's a relatively short um, term product. All right, so let's make another trade. Now, what I've got here as well, um, we can also use take profit. So what take profit does is if we um, automatically say, right, if, if it goes to $150, then we c it will literally take uh, our profit when we've made that much uh, profit. So let's, um, let's leave that for now. What we would do, we'll just basically do manual. Um, so we will take our profits manually so let's go with another trade here so again that one lost quite quickly unfortunately because you see what happened it hit the barrier uh, but that's you know that's part of the trading and of course you know look at your money management don't put all your money onto one particular trade um, so right now we've got a new trade that's running let's go all right and this one's looking a little bit better so far so we've accumulated Okay, we're going to take the profits there. So in that case, we've basically doubled our money. We've, we, we closed out uh, with 118 
um, of profit. Now, it's always a trade-off between do you take lots of small profits, um, and then of course, you know, when it does hit the barrier, you will take obviously um, your whole stake loss, or do you let it run? And that's something to look at. I've actually written a little ebook on this as well, which is available from Derriv at no charge. Um, so I give you a few more ideas in there. But that is basically accumulators in um, in five minutes. Obviously, these, these are the trades that we had. Um, I think the best thing for you to do is to um, try it on demo account. And then when you're ready, you can try it trade with as little as $1. So just try trading on $1 trades um, and see what it's like for real. Um, and I think you'll find this product, it's... It's got basically, it's a very good short-term product. You, with the volatility products, you can trade them 24 hours a day, seven days a week, so you don't have to worry about the markets opening. Um, and as I say, it's fairly easy to pick up. So uh, it's something maybe you, know, you want to add to your toolbox. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching.